Now, did you read the original Jonathan Swift before this? Uh, I did. I Well, my mum read it to us when we were kids, so... I'm sure a lot of the metaphors and more satirical, cynical side to the book went way over my head. But I remember enjoying it and being completely seduced by the adventure of it. And um, So this is definitely a more light-hearted Well, 45 approach. years ago, I studied a little bit at Cambridge. And oh, you I did? At, I was at Dartmouth, and did Jonathan really? Swift was touted as the best writer of all time. But he was me. very anti-English and Goodness and me. As you know this. He yeah, did. but that's really funny that you... Yeah. So did you study him and or did was, you study... Yeah. And he was, of course, he was a priest. He was anti-English. I didn't Irish. know he was a priest. I didn't yeah. know he was a priest. Well, he was, he was Irish. Oh, he was. I don't yeah. know why I thought he was... So he was anti-English. Ah, good for him. He was writing pamphlets for Ireland. Really? Yeah. That's amazing. I didn't know that. Yeah. Well, I thought you would have gotten upset by it. <laughs> no, that's all right. <laughs> I mean, in the movie, you're a Lily Putin, so you're portraying the English. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, I'm not that upset by it. Okay, because that, that was his point, is that the English were the Lily Putins and they were oh, right. treating the Irish as beasts and oh, wow. people, etc. Oh, how interesting. Yeah, it's fascinating. You should reread it now. I think I should, for yeah. sure.